In Audacity 3.1, an excellent time-saving feature is implemented for delete. Let's say I want to delete this part. Deleting this causes a shift in the timeline. Everything after that deleted part shifts to close that gap. Audacity 3.1 provided a solution to this problem. Separate out the part you want to delete into a clip, and that clip will now act as a smart clip. To split at any point in Audacity, click on that point and press Command I in Mac or Control I in Windows. You can now trim the edges to adjust that clip. When you trim, other parts beyond the trim point are reserved and can be restored at any point. I have separated a smart clip and let's now delete it. Seems like nothing has changed. It was working the same way before like adjusting other parts of the audio. So that feature Audacity promised in 3.1 is not implemented or it's a bug. Let's see what they say in the official Audacity video. Second, by default, if you delete one clip, other clips on the same track stay put. It works perfectly for them, which means that the feature is implemented. If we see the change log, this feature should work by default which is actually not true. You can find the settings from Audacity Preferences. From Tracks and then Track Behaviors, uncheck this editing a clip can move other clips. Now the deletion is working and the timeline is preserved. This is a massive improvement for those who want to delete some parts and want the existing timeline to be the same. Thanks for watching this video and see you next.